I received a bachelor and a master of science in Italy and then went on to do my PhD still in Italy at the University of Cassino. Uh, during my master and PhD I uh, have traveled a bit. I did the second year of my master in Germany at RWTH Aachen. Uh, then during my PhD I was a visiting researcher at the University of the Basque Country in Spain and at Tokyo Institute of Technology uh, in Japan and finally here at the University of Nottingham. I have been working mainly on mechanical design for robotics. I have developed humanoid robots, walking robots, rehabilitation robots and now I'm here working uh, in inspection and maintenance robotics, designing uh, and modeling snake-like robots. So the best thing about my job here is probably the opportunity to work closely with industry. So we're not only doing theoretical research, we're also seeing the application of that research into actual problems like onto a real system, uh, air engines, nuclear plants and stuff like that. So from a technical point of view, uh, my favorite thing about the UTC is the incredible amount of like, technology and knowledge that's available for everyone. We have uh, great laboratories, great people in it, and the most important thing is that we have, well, we used to have before the pandemic a Cake Monday every week in which one of us cooked some cake and we had a chance to eat it all together. Most of the projects I'm currently working on involve snake robots of certain kind for inspection, maintenance, intervention in very hard to reach areas. So I mainly design and model structures that are like this, very flexible, controlled with cables. And we can insert them thanks to their very lean body in uh, air engines, nuclear plants and other like difficult to access areas. To perform tasks that human operators or other conventional robots cannot do. We having to deal and manage several projects all together rather than like being on a single project like in my PhD.